I made Fruit Ninja for the TI-84 Plus CE, but there's just one problem. Calculators don't have a touch screen. So how does it work? You can actually use your finger to swipe across the keypad using any key from the math key to the enter key. All of these keys translate to a position on the screen, and when you start pressing them in sequence, they perform slices in-game. This version of Fruit Ninja has everything, such as fruits, exploding bombs, and even pomegranates that allow multiple hits before eliminating everything else on the screen. You can also pause the game with mode and go back to the main menu, and you can also play the Zen game mode, which doesn't have any bombs, but it has a lot more fruits. This game was programmed in C and is compatible with any TI-84 Plus CE graphing calculator. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to install it and how to play it on your very own calculator. So first, what you're going to want to do is download all the required files, which I'll link in the description. And then first, you'll want to download Fruit Ninja CE off of the official Chemitech site. And you'll also need to download the C Libraries group file for Mateo C. Now, if your calculator is on OS 5.4 or earlier, that's all you need to download to your computer. But if you have a later OS, you will also need to download the Artifice shell from this page and follow all the directions on there. This page includes a download link for the Cabri Jr. app as well, so if you don't already have the Cabri Jr. app, then you'll need to download that. Well, how do you tell what OS you're on? From the home screen on your calculator, hit second, and then hit plus, and then hit enter on the about option, and your OS is listed right at the top. Now, grab your calculator and also grab a USB to mini USB cable. It should look like this. Plug those in and go back to your computer. Open up the latest TI Connect CE app, which I'll link in the description, and you should see your calculator pop up in the sidebar. Click the Calculator Explorer button on the left, and it should start to list all the files it can see on the calculator. Now, go into your Downloads folder and locate all the files you just downloaded, and then go ahead and unzip the Fruit Ninja file and locate the fruitninja.8xp file. Select that file and the clibs.8xg file, and if you're on an OS later than 5.4, then also select the Artifice file and the Cabri Jr. file. Drag those files over to TI Connect CE, and you should see the upload window pop up with all the files that you just dragged over. And then hit send and wait for it to finish transferring to the calculator. Once that's done, you should be able to start playing the game on your very own calculator. If you're on OS 5.4 or below, just hit the program button, find Fruit Ninja, and hit enter twice to run the game. If you're on an OS later than 5.4, then attempting to run the game the same way will result in an invalid error. So instead, you'll want to hit the Apps button, find Cabri Jr. and open it, and then once you're inside of Cabri Jr., you'll want to open the Artifice shell. Once you've opened the Artifice shell, you should be able to run Fruit Ninja from there. And that's all there is to it. You can use the same process to download any program you like, which Chemitech has a ton of good programs, so feel free to explore that. I hope you enjoy making an absolute ruckus swiping and slicing across the keys on your calculator, and I'll see you in the next video. Enjoy!